Right now, in this ring, I want to see Matt Tremont. If given one more chance, I want to earn the win and earn the right to stay in one of the best locker rooms that the New Jersey Yankees has today. Cannonball, on point wrestling. I'm going to tell you this. April 18th, you came in the middle of this ring and you proved yourself like a man and went face to face with, and with me in front of all these people. Yeah. You earned my respect, you earned the job, and I'm pretty sure you earned the respect of the old fool faithful. But I can understand how you feel, Cannonball. It burns you deep down inside that you didn't get the job done and you didn't get the W. I can understand. You want a rematch? One more time, me and you, Cannonball, that's fine. August 29th, when we return, we will do it. Who knows it in Cannonball, too? But if we're going to do it, we're going to make it mean something, brother. You see, in 1995, 20 years ago, this year, two men in the hallowed halls of the arena made a match famous and gave guys like us hardcore wrestling. They made a name for themselves to give a guy like me and you to do what they I do for each and every one of them. 20 years ago, the bad breed of Ian and Axel Rotten had themselves taped, fist, broken glass, high pay, fucking death match. That's not it. of one of the most historic hardcore matches in this business. There's only one man to referee that match, and that's the undisputed king of hardcore, Ian Rotten. <laughs> August 29th, Cannonball, you got it. 20 year anniversary, Taipei Deathmatch. Ian Rotten comes back to the 